Hey, Austin. Hey, Christopher, how you doing? <laughs> Hey, Ann, how are you? Hey, Barb, how you doing? Hey, Kettle. What's up, Kenny? I'm doing okay, Austin. Oh, it's okay, Kenny. I, I know you probably got to work tomorrow. Damn it, how do I do that? Hey, hey, man, how you doing? What's up, Oxy? Hey, Kate. Who's that, Oxy? He shouldn't be. I unblocked him. Hold 
Shit. Hold on. He's unblocked. Ah, uh, shit. Mm-hmm. <laughs>
Okay, there we go. I'm back. Wait, what's the matter now? He was talking bad about me? <laughs> Let's get to the bottom of this. What happened? He actually defended an upper. Uh, yes, yes, yes. After what happened, that's interesting. Can he's an awesome dude? What happened tonight? Here she asked Jesus was talking shit with Amanda. It was false. Snive. Jesus was talking shit. So what was going on? I'm I'm not sure. I heard he was unblocked. I was surprised after everything went down. I I don't know. Uh, I Jesus from the beginning he's moved on. Must look here, pastors. <laughs> I don't know. Cheever, I'm going to tell you something right now, okay? I don't give a flying shit what you think, okay? If you don't like the fact that I have been to PayPal account in my life, then you can kindly leave, okay? And I will have one of my mods guide you out of here, okay? I have it in my, pinned at the top of my thing for a very good reason, okay? There's a good reason why it's there. If you don't like it, then kindly leave. Okay, I don't have to explain anything to you. So, you know what? I've had enough of you. You are a shit stir. You are now being asked to leave. Savannah, could you please ask him to leave or can he get him the hell out of here? Block his ass. <clears throat> I have a job, Chiba, and you need to get one too and get a fucking life. I'm not dealing with you anymore. You were you banned. I'm done. The I I have it up there for a very good reason. Everybody knows my name, you know, and it's there for a good reason. Hey, Karen, how you doing? You're good, Jeffrey. So I'm patient now, doesn't she? Chiba's the only one that keeps going around trying to start shit with people. I'm tired of it. I've had enough, you know, and I don't, I don't need to keep dealing with that. Hey Shadow Runner, how are you? <laughs> you tired? Hey, Tifa, what's happening, brother? Hey, Brian. How you doing? What's up, Hateman? How you doing? <clears throat> Damn it. I'm doing good.
Oh, do you? Yeah, I started to get one because this this weather can't seem to make up its mind. Oh, did you? Let me get. When you say bars of soap, you're not talking about that Doctor Squatch soap, are you? I am blocked him, hate my. No, he, he's not blocked. I unblocked him. The only one I saw was Jesus Returns. I, or Jesus is Alive. Uh, G, Jesus is Love. <clears throat> hey, Deb. How you doing? What's up, Andrew? How you doing, buddy? Oh, what's wrong with your puppet, Lane? I use all the Dr. Squatch stuff, but the dealer is like, yeah, I did for a while, but it just, it was so expensive. It's like $7 a bar. And I just like, I'm, I'm like, nah, I had to stop it. This was a couple years ago. And then Walmart, you know, Walmart sells it now. It's good soap. I mean, there's nothing wrong with it, but it's just so damn expensive. Hey, Emma. Ah. Yeah, I, I don't go in Walmart very much anymore. It's up at the top, Emma. Do you see it? How do you, how do you do that? Hold on, let me do it again. Is that better? Oh, okay. Yeah, I clicked on it. You said hit the three buttons, but I I clicked on the thing now. Okay. Well, Emma, I guess I guess I should explain it to him. Okay, hold on one second, Lane. I'll let you up. Um, I wasn't on here last night. Um, <clears throat> and there was a reason for it. No. Uh, back in January, um, I got sick. In, well, actually in December. And I was out for about a month. My, both of us actually were sick. And... Um, 
we missed about, I don't know, three weeks of work. And what's up, Steph Richard? And so when I came back to work, um, apparently the people that I worked for had switched management. And I lost my job. And I lost about five paychecks with them. So from the 3rd of January up until, I don't know, maybe mid, mid February, I want, I want about 10 weeks without a paycheck. And that's when y'all saw me do that GoFundMe thing. Well, from early December up until now, I have not been able to pay my rent. And it's embarrassing, but yesterday I was, I was served an eviction notice. I've got 10 days to come up with about $3,500 or my wife and I are going to be thrown out of here. And, um, I, I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm, <clears throat> Yeah, and we have absolutely no money. Right now, um, right now, uh, I've got a part-time job. I have not been able to find anything solid because of my health. And uh, I'm only able to work about 15 hours a week. And I'm, I'm barely making any money. And uh, so yesterday the guy came and, and I don't even know what day, day it is. It's like, I guess Wednesday or whatever, Thursday, but, um, handed me the thing and we've got 10 days to come up with this money and we have absolutely no money to give them. And not only that, but we don't have a place to go if we get thrown out of here. And, uh, not only that, but we have to think about Baron too. And, um, you know, I know a lot of people on here are going to see this and they're going to say what they're going to say, but you know, look, I have never asked anybody for anything. I mean, I put up a GoFundMe a couple of months ago <clears throat> and I still caught flack for that and people made fun of me and, uh, you know, guys, I, I've never, I've never ever thought I'd be in this position to ever have to, to be in such a bad way where I didn't know how I was going to be able to get, like, I, I don't even, I don't even know, like, honestly, right now, what we're going to do. I'm, I'm worn the fuck out, and I'm just, uh, I'm honestly just, I'm just. Wait a minute, what's the matter? Okay, Elaine. 
And that's why I, I went up on, on Amanda's panel today because I, I want this stuff to stop because I can't handle it no more. That's part of the reason why I didn't go live last night. Because you know what? <clears throat> no, Kate, I took it down. I took it down because it was up for like three months. It sat there. And when I got docs back in Kim's a couple of weeks ago, they copied and pasted what I had typed in the story part of it and printed, posted it in her chat. And it embarrassed me really bad. And I just, and I took it down. I, I got to hold on. Thank you so much, Emma. Thank you. I appreciate that real a lot. Listen, I want to say this about all this stuff, the fighting and all of it. We just got to stop it. Okay. I want to talk to Jojo today. It's done. Okay. All, all of this. Thank you so much, Emma. I, God bless you, girl. I really appreciate it. What was what you did for me? Okay, I, it really means a lot. <clears throat> Listen, all, all this stuff that we're doing here, um, it. <clears throat> Elaine, please don't leave. Thank you. Well,
Hey, Castle Jewel. How are you doing, bro? <clears throat> There's just been a lot of stuff happening on here and it's just I can't I can't keep up with it anymore. And not with what's happening in my own life and me and Stephanie. And you know You know, I don't I don't want anybody to leave. I care about all of you, you know, and thank you, Shadow. I really appreciate it. I and I understand. <clears throat> you know, I mean yeah, we just all, you know, it's just too much. You know? Thank you, Christopher. I really appreciate it. Hey, Jersey, how you doing? Darren, how are the traps? So, uh, I just, but I was saying, uh, <laughs> Marlene, I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, it's really easy to get caught up in the addictions of drama on here. <clears throat> it it is. Yeah. So that's why I put a stop to it today. Because I don't I don't want to come on here every night and be going at, at you know uh, somebody pointed out to me the other day. That I have a beef with someone every week and that's going to change because I can't keep coming on here every night and going it's this person and this person and then, and then dealing with this stuff on the outside something's got to something's got to change that's not healthy I'm not sleeping at night 
I'm not going to bed at one or two o'clock in the morning. I'm keeping Stephanie up, you know. No, bear. Bear, get out of the trash. Come on. All right. Yeah, Shadow, it's it, it's tough. You know, it's tough. I know what those two you're talking about. I know it, it's tough. It is. Thank you, Sub. And you know, <clears throat> how you doing, Bertie? How you doing? You're the other reason why I did that, uh, Sub, because, you know, you, you've you always been um, the voice of reasoning with me. Like, you've helped me, you know, see the light with things, you know, and I don't like to, I don't like to upset you, brother, you know, and, uh, it's just not worth it, man. I mean, it's, it's not fun, you know. Yeah. Hey, Mr. Whistle, how you doing? You I get a lot of it at work. I refuse to be around negative people. It's like a poison. I've been thinking about just listening on you. Yeah, I mean, I guess it's, you know, it's sometimes, you know, I come on here every night because you, you people are great, you know? Like I, I have I enjoy coming on here and talking to all of you. Stephanie likes talking to you guys. I mean, you know, and but but it's it's the other side that is really like it's it's sometimes it just it just it destroys you, you know. And then when something on the outside in your real life happens, it 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 just it, it's over it's overwhelming. No, I love you too, Austin. Thank you. Especially as I've as long as I've been on here now, I've gotten to know a lot of you, you know, for a long period of time. Thank you, Christopher. 
Thank you. Drop it. Drop it. Drop it. Yeah, Bertie. Well, I mean, I had to set up a PayPal account because I just got an eviction notice. Um, my wife and I just got an eviction notice uh, yesterday, I think it was, or the day before. And we've got uh, 10 days to to come up with $3,500. So we're, we're not doing too good right now. That's why I wasn't on last night. Thank you, Bertie. I appreciate it, man. Yeah. Thank you, Emma. I really appreciate that. Come here. Yeah, Kate, there there's a few churches. Um, that, that I still have to reach out to, um, there's a place up here that we have to, that we're in, in, um, communication with now, but it's, I've got to go to them tomorrow, not tomorrow, but Monday and, and fill out a bunch of paperwork. So, and the lady told me that's their funding is like very, very limited. So I, I don't know what they'll be able to do for us. So, uh, but I am certainly going to be on the phone with them. Stay out of the church, Baron. Go lay down. Go lay down, Bubba. Go lay down. Go lay down. No. No. Some have good connections for rent assistance. Well, that's the thing. Um, in the county that I live in, thank you, Hayden. I appreciate it. Um, appreciate it, Castle. Appreciate it. Um, that's what we're looking into right now. They gave us a list of uh, churches and resources to, to look into. So that's what I've been on the phone with every day. Like literally er every day since this happened. They send you a packet and you got to fill out. It's like 20 pages of like they want everything. You got to have like two months worth of pay stubs and uh, they wanted all your information and, you know, yeah, Blank, I really, really appreciate it, brother. So I've got to go to, to the place where they're at and give them all my, uh, 
all my information and my ID and social security number. And then I got to wait. And, and I'm hoping that the landlord will be patient enough. Okay, hold on, Karen. Hold on. Thank you. Thank you so much, Karen. Thank you. I really appreciate that. Hey, Ford, how you doing? Yeah, I'm going to, that's what I've been doing. Um, I'm also going to, I'm going to be looking into another job tomorrow. It's a, well, here it's, it's, here it's, uh, yeah, it's emergency info. So it's pretty much, it'll refer me to the places that they've given me. Um, so I'll, uh. Man, it's just incessant tonight. So I'll be on the phone with them tomorrow, actually. So... Hopper does tour state or does your state have a workforce dot organization? Maybe all the offer systems. I'm not sure, Castle. Uh we have social services here, but that's about it. Um, as far as I know. Ours is by county by county. It's it's by county here. Some counties get more funding than others. So, and, and social services here, they, when it comes to like rental assistance, they, they, uh, what's the word? They delegate that out to specific uh, foundations who get grants from the state, from the, the gov federal government. Yeah. Yeah. And, and they, and they in turn will, and the HUD department here, um, will like their housing department is like a 15 year waiting list. So it's like, they don't, yeah, they don't, they don't do very much here. It's been 20 years since I've had a job. Yeah. Uh, it's a little different for me. Uh, I, I did physical labor for, for 30, 33 years. And now I'm not, I'm not as capable of doing that as I once was. So. Damn it, man. Okay. 
on somebody else and done it. So, here the best way to get a job is if you have computer experience. Like, that's the problem. What do you mean, Ford? Does it mark? Oh, Lord. Come here. Come on, this way. This way. Yeah. I mean, the resources they offer here. Um. I'm doing everything I can, uh, but it, it's 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 going to be because the funding right now is very limited, very like very very limited. From what I've been told, like some places they have no funding at all. So, yeah, do. Yeah, social services, yeah. I mean, um, the problem with them is that because Stephanie works and she works more hours than I, I do, we don't qualify for, and, and that's that's the kicker, is that... Oh, Lord. Her her job, she actually makes too much money for like any kind of like food assistance or anything like that. That's that's the bad part. And groceries here, you can forget it. Like they'll let you starve here. <laughs> so that's the bad part. You know, I don't know who the hell can afford to live off of, like, Jesus Christ, man. <laughs> yeah, I'm the lady's like, you can't make more than $28,000 a year on a family of three. I'm like, lady, who can afford to live like that? <sighs> so... I mean, I, you know, I don't know. <laughs> no, I mean, there. Let me take as well as some. I mean, there's food pantries in the county. But hey, Miss Phoenix, how you doing? There are Wednesdays and Saturdays, and that be hell that forces you to buy stuff that I can't even eat. You know, like because I'm diabetic, I can't. You know, like people. <laughs> I spent 130 in food, and there's literally almost nothing every year. Yeah, it is. I mean, hell, three years ago, I was almost in a diabetic coma because we couldn't afford to buy food. <laughs> you know, the food we were buying, my doctor's like, what the hell are you eating? And I'm like... <sighs> Thank you, DMS. Thank you so much. Okay, I really appreciate it. You know, and it's like now when you go to the grocery store, what you used to be able to buy, is it like Coffee Girl is saying, it's like you're spending more and getting less. Yep. And it's like, oh my god! I'm shopping at Walmart. 
You know? So it's it's just, you know. Yeah. Yeah, my and and I really appreciate what you're doing for me. I will not forget this. <laughs> yeah, I could just see me eight my look at the size of my hands. You think the handcuffs will fit? <laughs> They'll be double cuffing me, okay? I have, I'll be very inconspicuous in the grocery store. <laughs> I'll be going to and you Thank you, Emma. <laughs> well, yeah, I mean, <laughs> it's just nuts. Yeah, it, it really is. It is. It is absolutely nuts. Yeah, hey man, the to oh my god, the toilet paper prop uh, toilet paper gate was terrible. That was when I was a vendor. Thank you so much, Kate. Thank you so much. Much love to you. I really appreciate it. Body armor juice and some green value potato chips. Yeah. No, <laughs> listen, I don't know. I, who knows who's through, you know? Hey, give me a second, guys. I'll be right back. I've, I've got to go to the bathroom. I've got to put some on my arms. I think it's just your nerves. Where, where is it at? Okay. The coffee maker? Yeah. The coffee maker? Why the sink, honey? Yes.
I was writing off a message under my Uncle Tifa account and it timed out. Then I got an email saying my Uncle Tifa channel has been removed permanently. From where? From YouTube? Oh, shit. Yo, oh, no, I know. That's his other. That's his other channel. Damn. I'm gonna talk to him tomorrow, John. Oh, damn, Tifa. I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm gonna call him tomorrow. I, I just. Damn. Well, at least you got subs on it. I mean, shit. Well, let me do one thing for you, brother, because I know I don't want you to get timed out in here. I added you as a mod, uh, Elysium, so you, or Tifa, so you don't get... You don't get timed out in here. I don't know how you could have gotten timed out to begin with. You were mod in here. Yeah. Can you get it back up? Or are you going to appeal it? That is so weird. Well, is it Jesus? Jesus uh, loves returns, or Jesus is is love? Because I didn't see Jesus's love returns in there. All I saw was the one. Let me let me go take a look, man.
Yeah, he's not blocked. Hey, Elizabeth, how you doing? No, none. We're just... The bats flying around your balcony. Oh, okay. Bats are kind of, uh, <laughs> if you get them in your house there, they could be interesting. They're cool to watch. I've, my aunt got one in her house one time. But yeah, they can, they can get inside in, in your, in your attic and nest, but yeah. Mm-hmm. I think they fly to sound, like the sonar. Yeah. Yeah. 
Bat caves. Ooh, that's got to be funny or fun. Oh, Lord. Poking the bear. Of course he is. <laughs> what are they alive? Oh. Can hear you in the background. And he walked up to Barb to show her what you were talking about. healthy to fire of a lame ass girl. Yeah. I don't know, man. Like, I, you know, I got my own, I got shit to deal with my own life. Like, I always got for them. Let them say what the fuck they want. I don't care. Like, I, you know. Because they want to know if I'm talking about them or not. I, I, I don't, like my life does not revolve around talking about them too. Yeah, I know, right, Ford? No, you have Crohn's, and as big as her, I do have Crohn's on only way. Oh, I mean, that's not really size. I mean, that's that's just that's just um, something people have. Shadow. I mean, you can have that at any size. I mean, if you have it, I heard that was some miserable shit to have. And like, I mean, I knew one lady who was my mortgage broker. Um, she had it. And she ate some, she ate uh, a corn product, man. It shut her down for a week. Like, whew, some bad stuff. Or something that had corn in it. And it's not good. So, I don't know. You only weigh 73 pounds, girl? 
I need to show you how to put some weight on. You started at 290. So I uh, did you say seventy three? Seventy three pounds? Wow. You're tiny, girl. A fort or somebody, the castle said she was watching my live or something. I guess they're watching me to see if I'd say anything about them. I'm like, well, what the hell am I going to say about them? I don't have nothing negative to say about them. <laughs> hey, there ain't nothing wrong with that. I mean, kids' clothes are just as expensive, you know? You know? Yeah. Yeah, Karen, I know, right? I mean, we could go back to living like the Amish. I mean, shit. They've been building their own stuff. They, they live off the land. Well, they don't really live off the land. They don't, they'll fool you. The Amish up here, man, they, they live like no electricity. Some of them do. I see some Amish driving cars. Palm trees are but yeah. I could see myself using a fig leaf for a pair of underwear. Not. Two giant fig leaves with a giant piece of duct tape around my ass. Wouldn't that be attractive? Walking sideways everywhere. Why is he walking like that? Because I was too cheap to buy underwear. God, man. This <laughs> makes you want to laugh, doesn't it? God, man. Yeah, that's what I mean. What happened to that? <laughs> yeah, I mean, people walked around naked at one time. What happened to that? Why can't we just go back to doing that? You know, fuck it. Does everybody walk around naked? <clears throat> Let's 
get over our shyness, you know? Oh, my goodness, man. <sighs> I'm Bill someone locked. Huh? Someone locked. Oh, what's I saying? Or is her or to get turned around? That is not what I'm typing. Mean, what the hell is wrong? Oh, how you doing, Ann? I hope you're feeling better. Oh, my God. Karen was naked at Walmart and she got kicked out. <laughs> really, Karen? <laughs> yeah, I can see Baron eating a fig leaf. Maybe not wearing it. Yeah, hold on, hold on. Kick away some of this. There's a link, Ann. Okay, Emma.
And did you find the, the uh, link? Yeah, she probably is. Oh, there she is. You there? Yeah, I'm here. How you doing? <laughs> Can you hear me? Yeah. Hello. Can you hear me? Yeah. You hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Okay. Okay. Now say something. You good? If you're messing with me, don't be messing with me because I really cannot <laughs> hear you. <laughs> no, I'm I'm I can hear you. I can hear you. Doctor, I cannot hear you. Hold on. That's why. Say it again. I can hear you. Okay, I can hear you now. Okay. No, I wouldn't mess with you. I know you you're you're at the hospital, so your Wi Fi not be may not be the um the greatest. So um so how are you doing? Uh, are you are you uh are you getting better? Another surgery tomorrow. Another one tomorrow? What what for? I mean, well, I mean, I know what what for for, but first of all, 
Let me give you an example of somebody showing how they truly are in the hospital. That's how you show the names. Oh, we know you're in the hospital, girl. You don't have to do that. Not this. That I, I, ain't none of that necessary, darling. You, we know you're in the hospital. Oh, I don't care if anybody believes me or not, but I know I'm not lying. Yeah. That's how it's supposed to be. We know you're there. We know you're there. It's not a mental hospital, but for me, it should, maybe it should be now. Oh, right. there's some more <laughs> ammo. So, anyway, what, um, that's when so, we get the mission. Are you, um, past the infection part? Uh, I'm, I'm assuming that that's what We're was, was, on it. We're working okay. on it. Okay. Oh, man. The problem, the problem is okay. I don't know if I'll be able to still see this too. Me do. Yeah. This right here. That's the pump. That's the pump. Yeah. And that's like what drains or, or impure whatever. Yeah, and that drains the, the stuff out of your leg. Yeah, this would be the third or fourth time. You know how boring okay. it is to be sitting here doing not a daggum thing. Well, and you know, I I have been worried about you. Okay. I I want you to know that. Uh, we have, me and Stephanie have been praying for you well, and, you. um, you know, uh, I don't, you know, I can't even imagine what, what, it, what it is like being there going through that, you know, um, are you, uh, is it like, Oh, what would uh, do I hurt? Yes, I mean, is it yes? Where's your, where's your husband at? And he's at home right now because we have the two dogs. Oh, and I'm a grown ass adult, so they're just pups, but they get daddy, and I'm fine with that. I insisted upon it, you know, right? I'm gonna have to. Uh, put off having them fixed because, well, he has to have cataract surgery now. Oh, uh, well, my dad just had that ha happen. He he just got his other eye done. Sorry, I'm last. Nervous, so. Yeah, well, do what you got to do. They gave you Doritos, right? Well, eat them up. Um. So they um they're gonna go in and, and clean up what what's left of the infection tomorrow i'm i'm, I'm hoping and get you all Thank you. get you all fixed up and i just want to say something nothing against anybody or anything there's rumors flying around blah 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 i have no ill will toward anybody i'm not trying to what's the word you know, drama rooms or try to start drama. I'm not mm -hmm. trying to go behind somebody's back to make friends with somebody else to get somebody else jealous. Y'all aren't doing the same thing to me. Shoot, and if anybody was, I wouldn't want to be their friend anyway. This is not an act, guys. As you can see, I have everything. It's not just me saying it. I'm showing. <laughs> Oh, shit, yeah, it's showing I'm 56 years old. <laughs> we know. I, well, I'm not saying it to be sarcastic, but no, no, and you, you don't have to do all that. You don't have to do all that. I mean, that's, you know, that, you know, people people feel they, they you know, on here have to question people. Afraid. It doesn't bother well, me. Well, you know, I mean, that, that's just bullshit. You know, you, you're a grown adult. Right. 
you know, we know that you're, you're being taken care of in the hospital right now. And, and that's totally not necessary. You know, I mean, you know, obviously you're it's laying in a hospital bed, you know, it's not like you're on the set of a TV show, you know, on, you know, and this is all set up, you know, like we, we know that's not the case. I wish you know? it was. Yeah. I mean, well, I do too. I wish you weren't, you know, laying up in a hospital. I wish you were home with your husband right now, you know, and not having to suffer like that. But, uh, I'm trying to fix the lights. Hold on. Yeah. It looks kind of, kind of dark in there. Well, Feather Mucker. See, I didn't see him. Oh, Peekaboo. Well, that's not really fixing him. No, well, that's as good as it's getting until he comes back, the nurse comes back in. But, uh, yeah, I mean. I'm just saying much here much. lately, over the last six months to a year, guys, all this juvenile delinquency bullshit. We're not teenagers anymore. Yeah. And it's in your high games and all this kind of bullshit. If that's mm -hmm. the way y'all want to play it, God, I want to offer on a different miracle round. Yeah. Yeah, it's just been too much. And, um, you know, like I, said, I have no ill will to anybody from just not playing that game anymore. No. Some people need to be called out on some of their stuff. Absolutely. For lying such. In poetic ways, yes. Does it need to be done childishly? Maybe. Maybe it's the only reason to get the, the other only way to get their attention. But after that, it's closed off. But it depends on those that person involved. I'm not saying anything, you know, what's going to be said or done, because I don't know. No idea. I'm just saying, I'm me, and I do me. That didn't sound right. You know, there... Never mind. This one time at Bank Camp? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> yeah. Well... That was funny. <laughs> I know what reference that's from. I know what reference that's from, man. Mm -hmm. So... Life is too short, Dean. Put a stop to it today. And there, there's no more of it because. Hold on, I'll be. All right. Hello. Hey. Hey. Eat again. Just some chips, baby. Yeah. Can I call you back in a few minutes? Yeah. Okay. I love you. Love you. Bye. Bye. The hell does he mean again? Hmm? <laughs> What's he doing again? Last well, time he told me it was four or five hours ago. What does he mean again? Yeah, I get to eat every four or five days. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I don't know what you've been talking. You're talking about right now because I haven't been around. So oh here. no, just a lot of stuff's been happening. And fill me in, brother. <laughs> no, uh, when I wasn't on live last night because we got a me and Stephanie got an eviction notice yesterday. Oh no! Yeah, and um, Sorry. so uh, that's. Well, a lot of the things, you know, a lot of shit over the last week, um, things have been actually, I mean, <laughs> just the last week, you know, the last couple of months have been really bad for me and her. And um, the last uh, probably two weeks have been building up. And then here Monday or Tuesday, we got a knock on the door and and um, they're the guy who takes care of the community handed us a letter and it was a, a notice of intent of X. So I have I not been, uh, well, I have 10 days to come up with $3,500 before they're going to court. And, uh, so it has not been a pleasant last couple of days. And that's why I, I sent you that message the other day because I I like when when you were live the other night, my I have been 
like, yeah, I've been live and I've been, but my, I've been like dealing with so much crap and, you know, I want to apologize to you now because I'm sorry that you've been in the hospital and, you know, hey, I've really. You can't wait on everybody's live to go live, Gene. Well. I had no idea. You know. Granted. But you can't well, wait on everybody's live to do a live. Otherwise, you'd never go well live. It, it is on, Karen. Um, and. Well, you know, and, and so I just, I just wanted you to know that, you know, and I, I did talk to stats today. Um, I sent her, I sent her a message yesterday and she got back with me today. Um, I've just had, I've just had so much stuff and I've been making phone calls and trying to get this stuff straight because I don't, you know, we get put out of here. I, I we have literally no place to go. And plus we have Baron and, and I'm not. I am not giving him up. So we've we've got to find a place to live, and and we have no money towards anything. So, you know, we're we're just like, uh, you know, I've got like a thousand things going on in my head. And then, make matters worse, that same night that that Elaine was talking about you being live, then JoJo comes in and decides that he wanted to confront me about something, and then. Out of everything, I stayed up till two o'clock in the morning dealing with that, and so I was up all night. So, yeah. I yeah. Understand. So I got, I just this has been a very bad week, and I wasn't even going to come on live tonight until I got home, and and um, just like you know. <sighs> so I understand because the first for the hospital thing, it's the first five days is five hundred dollars out of my pocket. Right. And then after that, it's, they pay so much. And after that, it's, you know, whatever. So for the first time, when I first had the surgery, it's five, um, 500. So that's what, 2,500 I had to pay. And this yeah. time it's starting, oh, it starts over because it's been over a week. It's two and a half weeks. Right. So that's starting over again. <laughs> But for longer. Yeah. So I get yeah. That part. It's just never, it's like it, 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 you know, the way things are, you know, it, it, it's like it's, it started all the way. This started with me and her back in December when I got sick and she got sick. We were both sick for three weeks. We missed Christmas. We missed everything. And then when I went back to my job, I was there for five days and then. The managers, the new managers there, are like, yeah, everything's going to be better. It's going to be great. We're going to sit all you down. And we're going to talk to you. And then one night, I'm there all day, and the guy calls me up. He's like, yeah, we're letting you go. And I'm like, I've gone for six weeks without a paycheck, and you're telling me you're firing me? So I went from there all the way up until almost the third week of February or second week before I got a paycheck. And it, <laughs> it was like $93. And I'm like, you got to be fucking kidding me so i just you know like i i couldn't find anything but a part-time job that's like not even 20 hours a week you know so i we're not even making it on that and uh trying to find anything you know when you can't do laborious you know like work like i used to be able to do is impossible because i don't have computer skills i don't have the the you know the uh, experience like you know some people do because I did laborers jobs for the last 32 years you know and my health isn't the greatest you know I, I ended up losing my my uh, insulin because of my insurance change when my job uh, when I lost my job so I ended up putting 35 pounds back on I told her that today I'm like <laughs> I gotta go back to the doctor and get my sugar checked again because I was having a hard time breathing at work today you know, so I think my sugar. I, I got a question on the um, whole sub thing. Or I'll ask you what after or something. My sub, I mean, I have my sub. I'm a, uh, I have my wrench now. But when I first came back in, it wasn't there. 
Oh, that. Um, I have a rogue mod, and everyone's was taken. I and that wasn't that wasn't you. That was that was everybody. I just you. <laughs> it, it was. I was waiting for you to come back in so that I could give it to you. So that that was uh, that that was because of that, not because I was for any reason. That was just because of that. Everybody said the same thing. Like, where's my wrench? I'm like, give me a second. Let me drop down and give it to you. So it was because of that. I I've got like my block list is like 300 or 400 people long. Every night, I'm in there unblocking people. It's, it's still happening every day. Every freaking day, I'm getting people blocking me. Or blocking. Like, it's, it's driving me nuts. I have one, It's a certain person who has hit his channel, and it's just boom, 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 going into my past lives. I've got to go in and, and disable the chat replay so they can't do it anymore. It's driving me batty. So that's the reason why, not because of any, not for any other reason. So I had to go in and there's a, a function because I just learned how to do it on my phone. I thought you had to have a computer to do it, but on here you can go in through uh, Google and you got to turn your phone sideways and it'll let you go to the uh, community or the YouTube desktop. Now the screen isn't all that big, so you're you're not dealing with a whole lot of space. But it lets you go through and check all the uh, the which McCallits in there. So, but God, there was a I, I was checking them and checking them. Just as I got to the bottom of the screen, it says, "Do you want to see the other two hundred and fifty-seven more?" I'm like, "Holy shit!" What? So yeah. So yeah, everybody that got had a wrench had to have. I had to, I had to take them, and then I had to replace them as you guys come back into the room. So that's that's what happened with that. So yeah, just still active. So as of now, I am. I'm just giving everybody a wrench um, because the bastard is still doing it, and. There's nothing I can I can't do anything about it because he's not I, I can't even because he's hit his channel I can't even see him on my uh, my mod list so mm. yep you did keep some that are managing mods though yeah. Oh, matter of fact, I got to change yours back to that because you were a managing mod. I'm glad you said that. Yes. Oh, if you don't want to, that's fine. I was just making sure you had some that were. Yeah. Yes, you were. And I'm glad you you reminded me of that because you were one. Or Jesus, but one. Yes, I, I've got to unblock Lord. Um, Jesus is not blocked, by the way. Eight months. I don't know why. I don't know why he can't type, but he is not blocked. I did not see him. I will check after the stream again, but I did not. Yeah, that, that's just a sad thing. You know, that's why I've got all wrenches. I mean, if I got to wrench everybody that comes in here, then, you know, I mean, that's what I got to do. But I only have manager mods of people that I trust, like Ann and, and Stephanie and, and a few other people. So You, uh, you have found out who the, the rogue mod is, right? 95% sure. Okay. Yep. Okay. You're on the phone with him? Damn, I'm here on Windows. Um, I, yeah, I checked the block list. Hey, my, he's not on there. Seriously, he's not on there. I promise you, he's not. I'll check. Tell him I'll check after the stream. Um, maybe it's my phone or something. Now, but I checked twice and I did not see him on there. I did unblock him once, but I didn't see him on there the second time. So, yeah. 
So what time is your, your surgery tomorrow? Two. Well, it's supposed two? to be in the morning, but they just came through and told me it's at two. So are they going to let you eat breakfast or anything? They said they are, but I won't be hungry for breakfast. Oh. To sedate my ass and let me just wait for it. That's what I mean. Just let them sedate you so that you, you don't even think about it. I mean, because when you have like, the, well, they'll give you the IV fluid, they right? That's right. Oh, no. How long would it take the surgery? Around an hour, maybe two at the outside. Maybe an hour to 30 minutes on the inside. I mean, it just depends on what's going on. Right. Well, how long do they think you're going to be in there for? Up to a month. Up to a month? Oh, boy. But I'm hoping this will be the last one or two because I, I just really don't want to be in there anymore. What do they think caused it? I mean, just... What? It just started leaking for no reason? Yeah. They have, they have no idea. What did they uh -huh. say? Hold I can't remember. But as if it comes up, I'm just going to start spilling it out because I don't remember, to be honest. Right. Well... Yeah. It sucks. When you get old, you're not supposed to fall. I'm just saying. Yeah, well, at least you got it fixed, Ann. I mean, at least you're doing something about it. Damn. So I told the nurses and stuff. I've already sold like five of my focal pins. Said y'all are paying for my fund. My fund be fun again. Not be in this hospital. <laughs> well, I want that one? No, I want that one. And it, it, there's enough to go around, ladies and gentlemen. Right. My best nurses so far have been the male nurses because they're so freaking funny. Took one of them to come out of the shell, but it's funny. Yeah. Well, I mean, are you getting sleep in there? Or are you getting, or are you, no? No. Are they giving you anything? No, they're not giving you any, like, sleep aids or anything like that? Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> <Dr>. Oh. <laughs> yeah, uh, doctor. <laughs> <laughs> that really hurt. Some serious man. No. <sighs> hilarious. I mean, hilarious. <sighs> Closer port. This my IVs got popping out, and I'm allergic to um uh, uh, adhesives. So I can only have band-aids on there for like 24 hours, and that's it. Right. So they put it not at full port, but one that's one step below that is not going to come out. And it's deep, deep, deep. I don't even feel it. It's not. When that, wait a minute. That was on the other arm the other day. That's the one I'm showing you right now. I can't wear that. It's not as deep. It's not in the bend. It's up here. It's oh, up okay. Here you see that? A little bit of muscle? Yeah. Okay. Shit, you got as much... You almost got as much as I do. That's, that's about as much as I got. <laughs> Don't pay attention to this floppy stuff underneath, okay? okay. That's what I got. 
Not a central line, but it's the one below a central line. Okay. Not as good. But it's it's better than straight you know, IV line. They can take um, blood from this as well as give medicine through that. Right. Yes. Yes, Emma. <laughs> no, it's still there. It's boring. You guys are funny. I have to is the food to do. is the food good there? Are they feeding you enough? You really got make me answer? No, no, no. I would fucking go crazy if I was in the man. I that hey. <sighs> Wow, I can't say that. I'd probably lose 150 pounds if I was in a hospital. Ooh, ick, ooh, and bleh. Those are your answers. Right. They had a couple things that are pretty good. I had chicken marcello the other day. And I'm thinking, looking at the menu going, oh my God, this can be so gross. It was delicious. Right. That's one meal a month that would be good. Yeah, I mean, hey, they can surprise you. Is, you. is your husband allowed to bring you anything? Oh, yeah. He brought me Starbucks today. Oh, okay. I get the weak Starbucks, otherwise it messes with my tummy, if you know what I mean, sir. Oh, sir. yeah, yeah. You don't want that in there. No, especially since I'm not allowed to go to a regular toilet. I have to use a bed psych mode. Thank you so much, Emma. Okay. You have a great night, all right? <laughs> Popsicle girl. <laughs> Don't get down. I know it's easier said than done because I did that all day today. So no worries. Come on in. I have to mute for a second, guys. Okay. They're just checking on me. No, Kelly, you're fine. After I get home from the hospital and get, you know, settled in a little bit, I'll start my other channel up good. Yeah. Yeah. MPTs. Remember? Oh, yeah. I, I subbed it out already, didn't I? Yeah, but I haven't done any content on it yet. Oh, okay. And that's what I'm going to be working on. Now, did you get the did you get the uh, the ramp thing done with your house? Yep. You want to see it? Let's see. And it's hot, so I got you. Okay. Thank you, honey. Yep, for free. Thank you, Lord Jesus, because uh, the VA paid for that for us. Oh, okay. Well, there you go. And they fixed the hospital bed for us, too. Wow. No, because they had gotten Dave a hospital bed from when he had that... Um, Arterial transvein transplant, whatever. Right. And he was in that bed six weeks minimum. 
Yeah. So the uh, it was just a mechanical, not a mechanical, but a um, an electrical th issue. So they fixed yeah. that. Oh, okay. Am I glitchy or is he, guys? Do what? I was asking if you were glitchy or am I? No, it seemed like I got glitchy for a minute. I don't know if that was you or me. All right, hold on. Yeah, Tifa. There you go. I don't show you yet, Tifa. I see you in chat. Yeah, give me one second. I'll drop down and uh, I'll give him a wrench. There you go, Tiva. I'm going to let everybody up here and give everybody else a chance. And I will see y'all later. <laughs> Okay, Ann. Well, listen, good luck with your surgery tomorrow, okay? And, and please, just we'll be praying for you, all right? Thank you very much. Love you, guys. Okay. Love you, Bye. too. Bye. Okay, Tifa, I will do that, brother. Thank you. Yes, she is. <coughs> yes, she is. She's a very nice lady. Do <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> yeah, everything's good. Everything's good.
Hopefully, I'm not talking to my that landlady tomorrow, man. Keep Barb. Can't take no dick to Can't take no dicks. Take me out. <laughs> 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 oh, God, man. That's funny. Yeah, you need to you need to burn some sage on your new channel, man. Burn it, man. Cleanse your channel, brother. <laughs> That's fucking funny, man. <laughs> oh, shit. You're funny, Tifa. <laughs> oh, shit, man. Well, look, guys, I'm going to get off here because I got to get up in the morning. But you guys have a good night. I thank y'all for being in here tonight. And uh, I'll, I'll hit you up on your email, um, Tifa. I'll reach out to you tomorrow. So, y'all have a good night. I love all of you. Okay? And uh, thanks for supporting me tonight. So, I will be, I will be on here tomorrow night. Peace out. <laughs>